Hey everybody, welcome to my channel. I feel like I need to explain myself here. Um, I messed up. It happens. It happens all the time to me. Uh, so, Model 1s. I'll flip this around so that's not backwards. They contacted me and asked me if I would um, do a review and swatch for you guys their beautiful polishes. And these are the color cubes. And they have a collab with three amazing people. Um, Saxon, she is a movie star and her palette is called Color Confidence. And it is a beautiful kind of fall tones. Um, absolutely gorgeous. These polishes are wonderful. I did swatch them all. When they contacted me, they asked me to do this and um, I thought they were sending the three palettes. Um, and I actually said, hey, I'm very excited about the um, retro, a uh, rich girl retro, because I've been looking for jewel toned, a jewel toned palette forever. Especially one that was kind of metallic. Regular polish gel, I didn't care. Really was excited about this one. And he is a nail artist to the stars. So he does um, Selena Gomez, J-Lo. He did her wedding. One of her weddings. I don't know how many weddings has she had. Many. Anyway, he does movie stars nails. He's awesome. And I really wanted to do that one. And I'm sorry, but he is the only one I had heard of. That was the only one that I knew. If I started to say personally, I didn't know him personally. Anyway, I was excited. I said, absolutely send them over. Um, when the package arrived, it was just two of them. And I'm sorry, I do not want to butcher his name. Like I know I would. I even asked Alexa several times how to say it. She couldn't get it right either. So I don't feel quite so bad. But I'm going to say Jacob because that's what I want to. I know that's not how you pronounce it. Um, I had the last name. I, I knew I was going to get the last name right, but I, I'm not going to right now. This one is um, the Pretty Unique palette. They all have nine pans. Beautiful colors. As you see, this one I completely emptied. There's a little bit left. But the reason I did that, I'll show you here in just a minute. <laughs> because I have people asking all the time, how many nails could you actually paint? with one of those little pans because there's nine pans in each palette and oh, i gotta put my glasses back on to see this um it is nine grams or 0.32 fluid ounces um so they're th they're solid so they go a lot farther anyway so the collab is called unlock and unleash and they all had um beautiful polish palettes and they have their like in sleeves so their particular palette is in a sleeve and it has like look I just dropped that one they have the colors on the side and they also have the color and the name of the palette on the back and then inside is just the usual box that um, Model 1s have with the beautiful packaging. And they also come with the brush. All right, I'm getting on with the story. I'm trying to get on with the story. Um, I received two palettes. And I thought that was all I was getting, which was okay. I was a little disappointed because the one that I really wanted, the Rich Girl Retro, I actually told her I was really excited about that one because I knew who that was. And it does not take away from these other people at all. Um, but I knew who he was, and I really like loved those colors. I didn't get it. That was okay. I emailed her back and said, I received the package. I'll get to filming right away. Um, and I'm going to say... 
Tara with Faces Low with Lacquer, she has already swatched all of these, so I'll put her link below. For sure, go check her video out because I think she swatches every single one of them. Um, I did, but that's the beginning of my long, stupid story. Um, so I, when I messaged her and told her I received them, she messaged me back with links. Um, a links to this grouping, and I do have a discount code, Guilene12, you can save 12%. These are $25 a piece for nine colors in a palette, I think is an amazing price. It's a really good price. Um, but she also sent me a link to soft gel tips, which I didn't get, and I'm like, mm, that's okay, whatever, I'll go ahead and link that too. I'm, I'm fine to promote that. Um, well, I was leaving town for a couple of days, so I knew I only had a day to film, and then I could um, edit that and upload it while I was gone. I went to my daughter's, my grandson's starting kindergarten, and we took him school shopping, and we also took him to a water park then the next day. So two days, I, I was gone. And while I was there, I edited the video and uploaded it to YouTube, deleted those off of my phone because I don't have room to keep all that, that raw footage on my phone. I have to delete so I can make room for more. Well, I noticed on my um, post office app that I had received another package on Monday, whatever. I just told my husband to get whatever was in the mailbox in the house. I didn't know what it was. And then the day that I came home, when I got home, there was another package in the mailbox from Model 1s, and I'm like, oh no, oh no, because I could not redo that. I, I couldn't get that footage back from YouTube to re-edit it. It just doesn't work that way, not from the edited app I use. I don't like YouTube's app. I don't use that. This is going on forever, I know. Get on with the colors. So... Anyway, I uh, opened up the packages and sure enough, I had some soft gel tips. These are very nice tips. I'll show you all of this in a minute. I'll show you all the things. And then of course, yes, I did get the Rich Girl Retro. All right, let's start with um, Saxons. And I'm sorry if I call her Saxton. I don't know why I wanna call her Saxton. That's not her name. That's not her name. It is Saxon. Anyway, her cube is called Color Confidence. And they are fall colors. And I'm just going to grab these. I have them over here. Um, these were not the tips that they sent yet. Because like I said, I already filmed that and lost that footage. Here are all the, are all the colors. They're absolutely beautiful. Beautiful fall colors. And here is the palette. I'm sorry. I, and messed up because they're so beautiful when you first open them and they're just perfect. Um, you never want to stir any of these up because they will become liquefied. Don't do that. Uh, this one, uh, it is just a really nice nude. Kind of a pinky. And if you can see, they apply so nice. And... With gels, you never should put a thick coat on there. You really need to apply thin coats. And when you're using the puddings, that's a very big advantage for beginners. You can't really put a thick coat on it. You just load your brush and brush it on, and it automatically is kind of, um, wow, the drag on it keeps you from applying too much. So it will cure and you won't have any um, wrinkles from putting too much and it not curing all the way through. And you see how opaque that looks. It, it does such a good job, it's so nice. And I'm gonna put this down here. And we're gonna do a little bit of a fade. Wipe off my brush. And 
And then if you want a little bit darker at just the tip, you can go in after you cure it and just kind of darken up just the tip. And here is all the swatching I did of his nails, his nails, the colors that he picked. Um, and now while we're at it, Guileen, why, oh why, is this black completely empty? Well, I'm going to tell you. How many licks does it take to get to the center of a Tootsie Pop? And if you aren't like Gen X or older, you may not know this. <laughs> it was a commercial for Tootsie Rolls. Um... I get asked so many times when I do these swatches, how many nails can you actually paint with one of these palettes, with one pan? Well, I'm going to tell you right now, 50. 50 layers is what you could do. So I used, I painted this black with two, and there are the colors. These are all two coats each. Um, so two coats on that black, and then... 48. So there are 12 tips on this swatch wheel and I did a little mark each time I, w I made another pass. So I mean be be grateful that you didn't have to sit through all that because I painted, <laughs> filmed that, deleted that. Anyway, this is this over black. This one. It is just um it will get opaque in two coats, as you can see on the, the swatch sticks that I did. Um, this one is over black, this green iridescent that is over black. It is blue. I don't really see any green, a little bit of kind of teal sh shift. And then this one is the pink over black, and it shifts a beautiful blue and pink. I, I don't know that you can see that. And then this one is just the silver over black. So there is some polish left in this one, but there you go. 50 layers is what you get from one pan. And I think that's awesome. Who's even going to use them all? I don't know. So you could, you could essentially paint all 10 nails with two layers with one pan. So I think some people maybe would go through the black quicker. I don't know. Maybe. Maybe not. But they're beautiful as you can see. Now I took the beautiful dark teal color and put one really thin coat. You can, you know, I dragged it really thin and got this beautiful color. Iridescent, shifty. Love it with this over the top of it. And I think this pink would be beautiful over this pink or either one of these over this blue or the purple. Um, you choose. Very versatile palette. And this one, again, is called Pretty Unique One. Very unique. Um, and I do feel like I need to tell you these do have Hema, and I am allergic to Hema, so I could not paint my nails. Here is the last palette. This is the Rich Girl Retro palette. This is absolutely my favorite palette, although I do love the other two palettes. They are beautiful, but this one is my favorite. Look at these gorgeous colors that are metallic, and then some beautiful bright creams. This is such an amazing nude color. And then I did a little bit of artwork for this nude color. And I used this beautiful like fuchsia pink. Move out of the way. Get, get, get out of the way. This beautiful fuchsia pink to make some leopard print. And then I took that black from the other palette and painted it around them. I mean it's it's super easy to paint those, anybody can paint a leopard print. Like, actually made them too uniform. Should just made them a little more messed up. And then 
the black around the edges just a little bit. You don't even have to like draw completely straight around them. And then I did the same over this brown color, beautiful color. And again, I just put some blobs of that nude color and then painted with this gold around the edges. That is so, so beautiful. It's, um, it's kind of coppery gold. And there are all the colors, the jewel tones, the green. They are very op opaque, as you can see. Two coats. I love them. They're gorgeous. And there is that reflective. And it's just like a topper. And I went ahead and Use the blue to put that reflective glitter over the top. I don't know, I feel like I need to turn off a couple of these lights so that you can see. There you go. I did do a little bit of um, more here at the tip, but so pretty. And these tips I used were from this soft gel tip that they sent. And they are beautiful. They're very nice. Uh, they are really thin at the base and they are pre-etched. Awesome when you're applying nails. You could use super glue or you could use um, a gel glue application for these. And you just wanna make sure that your tip fits all the way around and these are so nice as you see they are not straight I can't stand them when they're just straight um, these are have a beautiful apex perfect apex on them they have just enough C curve which fits most people's nails mine you know we, we're not gonna go into that how curved my nails are and my thumb is not as curved as the rest of them so I have a hard time fitting nail tips. Very nice tips. Uh, like I said, very thin here at the base, which is awesome. And then much thicker, as you can see, at the tip. So these are a beautiful shape. These are the medium almond. So they're medium length and almond shaped and beautiful. These colors are amazing. I love them all. Again, I apologize to you guys. I apologize to Model 1s because I wanted to get this video out. I didn't really have time to film yet again because I messed it up so many times. <laughs> it's not even funny. Um, so, what do you guys think? They are $25 a cube, which I think is an amazing price because you get nine colors for $25. Bucks. All right, um, thanks so much for joining me. I'm sorry this was kind of a mess. Thank you so much, Model Ones. They'll never send me anything again. Never send me anything again because I messed this up so bad. All right, thank you guys so much for joining me and I'll see you in the next one, I hope. Bye. Four course meal at Gam's house. Can of peas, bagel and cream cheese. Celery sticks and, and uh, carrot sticks and cherries. A ranch dip dressing. Mm -hmm. <laughs> this is why I am so distracted when I'm doing a video. Because I can just see this.